Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. And today's Mystery Monday video is all about teddy bears. So Pandora created quite a few teddy bear charms throughout the years. And I do have a few of them, not all of them, but the ones I have are so cute. And I thought I would share them with you today. First teddy bear I wanna share with you, I believe is called a Christmas bear. I'm not positive. I don't use it as a Christmas charm at all. And this little bear has a little mug of hot cocoa that matches the actual hot cocoa charm and I love this red enamel so as you spin the charm you can see he's wearing pajamas little red pajamas and this is what the back of the charm looks like I really like this deep red enamel and it fits perfectly on this bracelet my only wish with this charm is that it had a little bit more oxidization for the eyes or they used enamel for the eyes and the nose. I think the details could have stood out a little bit more, but as it is aging on the bracelet, it is getting a little bit more detailed. That is all the teddy bears that I have on this bracelet, so I'll continue on. And next up is this little cutie here. I wanna say these were called perfect pals, but I think I'm wrong. So. As you can see, there are two little bears and they're holding a gold heart and that is a real gold heart, not shine or anything. And then you've got their little feet. There's the hallmark and they have their arms wrapped around each other. So this is a really sweet charm. I currently don't have it designed on a bracelet, but I think I need to. And next I'm looking at my two-tone bracelet and I have the two-tone teddy bear on here. So this was a Mother's Day exclusive and they use this kind of mold of teddy bear in quite a few charms. It is so cute. I love this bear. I love the oxidized eyes and the little ears. Um, and of course he is holding a giant puffy gold heart as well. And this little bear is so precious and I'm really happy to have this one. It was an exclusive charm, so it retired quickly. So it's quite valuable right now on the pre-loved market. And Pandora used the same mold for this little bear here. So this is like the winter bear and there's a snowflake design on his sweater. Let's see if I can get it a little bit closer for you. So you can see the snowflake design on his sweater and he again has that beautiful enamel color for a hat and a green scarf. And this is what the back of the bear looks like. So as you can see, I did buy this one pre-loved and it desperately needs a polish. And now we're gonna look at my rose gold bracelet. And I do have a teddy bear on my rose gold bracelet. This is Dora Bear. Now, Dora Bear is actually holding one of her very own teddy bears. So it's a teddy bear holding a teddy bear. When I first received Dora Bear, I was actually really disappointed in the charm because it was just so shiny and none of the details stood out to me. Um, as it's aging, it's getting a little bit better, but I think Pandora could have did a lot more with this bear with the use of enamel. Um, even a little pink bow and her eyes more detailed. It's really hard to make out in person that she is holding a teddy bear. But I am glad I kept this charm because I was considering to resell it and it does belong on my rose gold bracelet. So I am glad I kept it. Okay, so next up is my Disney bracelet. Now this one I just shared with you recently and I'm not sure if you would count Winnie the Pooh as a teddy bear charm. So I decided to include it anyway, just in case it is considered a teddy bear? I'm not sure. But here is Winnie the Pooh in his honey pot and the back of the charm is quite plain. Okay, this is my pastel Disney bracelet and I have a teddy bear on here. Now this was an exclusive um, charm. I believe it's Pudsy Bear and I should have researched that a little bit more because it's exclusive I believe to the UK. Um, but it's a little teddy bear and he's super cute. Um, I managed to pick him up pre-loved and I'm happy I have him because he is adorable and I have him right now on my pastel Disney bracelet. And another teddy bear that I have is a petite uh, that belongs with the lockets and it's the teddy bear holding on to his bunny and I believe this one is called Perfect Pals. So I have a teddy bear petite. And then I have a bracelet that's a work in progress that's dedicated to my daughter. 
And in the exact same style as the petite, I have the dangling teddy bear. And I believe this one is called Perfect Pels. And then I have the original teddy bear. So this is the one that Pandora first created. And it is so well done. I love the use of texture they did for the fur and his little claws. And it looks like they try to put like little happy faces on the feet, but I could be wrong, but that's how it looks. And his just expression on the face is just really well done. So this is the retired original teddy bear, I believe. I don't think one was made before this one. And at the bottom of the bear is the hallmark. And then this is the back of the bear. So you've got all that wonderful textured fur. So my kids absolutely love their stuffies. So I actually have this bear on here. And this beautiful two-tone bear. So she actually has two teddy bears on her bracelet. And it seems like my camera now wants to focus. So I thought I'd give you another quick look at this teddy bear here, holding on to his mug of cocoa. So that is all the teddy bears that I have in my collection. And I hope that you enjoyed this video. It's a little bit different. Um, so thank you everybody for watching and leave me a comment below and let me know which teddy was your favorite. Thanks again, everybody. Take care. Bye-bye.